Hi friends, Rebecca here from um, San Pancho, Mexico. I'm sitting by our little lotus pond in the backyard or the side yard of our home. It's coming up on sunset time, it's my favorite time of the day. And we're gonna go down to the beach to um, watch sunset and have a little guacamole here soon. I have a good friend in town from Boulder who came almost by surprise, just a last minute decision, came to spend a week. Um, so that's really lovely. And um, there's been this theme that I've been wanting to share through this blog with you all, um, which is money. A few weeks back when I started my blog, I had um, a couple of people ask, a friend from college and a friend from childhood specifically, ask about the money thing. Um, so what's the money thing? What's going on with the money? How can you and Brad and basically be living your dream or doing what you want to be doing? How can you travel? How can you just leave your security, your safety, your, I guess, more regular life? Um, that would be a nine to five job, for example. And um, I wanted to share with you how we're doing that and, um, and what, our, what our situation is. So it's actually been years that we've been wanting to manifest um, Brad and, and myself having um, flexible jobs, like working freelance style so that we don't have to go into an office every day and, um, and work in a more regular kind of way. Both of us have done that and I started up, like uh, many of you know, in the corporate world and worked in um, multinational companies for a handful of years at the beginning of my career, 12 hour days and slept through the whole weekend and um, after a handful of years I burned out and realized that that's not what I wanted to do. Even though I didn't know what I wanted to do, I knew that was not what I wanted to do. So since then um, it's been quite a journey and I have been um, figuring it out, trying other things and, and still just noticing uh, my upbringing and my training that it's it's more usual to just have a job and do it that style. But where we are now is that um, Brad and actually came down here to Mexico where we're spending five, six months with a full-time job. He's actually working with a company in um, the US and he is working, um, the gift is that he's working from wherever he wants and he can do it from wherever. He's um, holding a job as a creative director and a He's doing branding and graphic design and website work. Um, so he's getting a, a salary, a full-time salary. And me, myself, I'm just working on um, a few different projects right now. But I'm, I'm not making money these days. So right now I'm living out of, out of savings. Um, but I'm working on um, organizing meditation and yoga retreats in in different places starting with here this little town where we've settled in the next few months and I'm um, volunteering at a community center here but that's pure volunteer so that's um, doesn't make the money flow in but that's what we're doing about the work slash money thing um, one thing I wanted to share with you that I noticed that a lot of my friends actually think that it's very expensive to travel and that they cannot afford to travel and that they don't have enough money to travel and um, from my own experience starting to travel like the world as a backpacker about 12 14 years ago um, i found that it's a lot cheaper often to travel than it is to stay at home wherever we are we just have to be creative with our solutions so right now we have this very, very gorgeous ocean home that maybe some of you saw. I gave you a little tour of um, last time I did a blog. And um, we're paying less than we were paying in Boulder. So it is not more expensive and we're having full on dinners for three, four dollars a night. And um, yeah, life is cheaper where we are. So it's, it's not a good excuse to stay at home and not travel because that we, can afford, we cannot afford it. It's more of a lifestyle change and it's more about our priorities, getting our priorities straight and um, knowing what it is we want. And for us it was to travel and for us it was to live abroad and be able to bring the work with us. So that's what we've been working on for years and if that's what you're wishing for, I hope that you can be able to do that too. And um, yeah, I'm excited to keep sharing with you guys in this way. Please, um, 
offer me comments and if you have a money thing that you want to share with me, some revelation or insight you've had around money, uh, please do so. I hope you guys are well. See you soon again. Bye-bye.